Right, good evening one and all. It is 20 past eight in the evening. This is Friday Eve. I'm at home. Just had my shower. Just coming out of the front room. Just got the, just picked my phone up on the selfie stick. Right, there's my boys want to go out the garden, I think. Here we go. Hang on guys. There's good boys. Right, let me turn that noisy radio off. There we go. Let me pop the camera up here for you. Oh, it's lovely. I've had a beautiful shower. There's my two boys waiting to go out. My sooty and my snoop. Right, guys, you good? Here we go. Good. Okay. And off you go then. Go, 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 go. Good. Right, the gate's shut so the boys are safe. Oh, that's fresh out there. <laughs> oh. Right, apple pies. Keep your eye on that door. I'll do it that way. So I'll put the camera over there. Gives me a little bit more room to work and you'll see the boys coming. Who are you going for first tonight? Who are we going for? If the door opens very slowly, it's usually Sooty. And if it flies open, it's usually Snoop. We had Sooty, we had Snoop last night, I think. It was Snoop first yesterday. But uh, Sooty came in right behind him. I think he was waiting for Snoop to open the door. So nothing at the moment. Let me get my apple pies while we're waiting, guys. Here we go. Right, it's the last day of the week tomorrow, which means it's thank God for Friday or, here we go. Hey, it's Snoop and see if Sooty comes in behind him. No, no, just Snoop at the moment. Sooty's there, I can see him just outside. You coming in, Sooty? Come on, Soot. Come on, I can see you there. Come on in. He's a good boy. <coughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, lovely. Right, my boys are waiting for the apple pie, so let's get them sorted, and then we can have a chat. Oh, lovely. There we go. Right, I had a call from um, my elder sister tonight. What are you doing? <laughs> That's sooty. I think he's uh, guzzled his water down. I think he's coughing because of that. Oh, look out. My apple pie's falling to bits here. <laughs> um, I had a call off my elder Stop it, stop. <laughs> uh, call off my elder sister. Uh, just going over the, um, the, what is it? Oh, the Frank Sinatra do. Um, oh, I'm trying to think what they call it. Uh, we're going to Frank Sinatra do in Cambridge. And my elder sister phoned up to confirm that it's all booked. Times we're going to meet up, times we're going to go in to see the show. Um, tribute. It's a, a Rat Pack tribute uh, band or group. Uh, come up, came over from the States and they're in Cambridge. Or they, they will be in Cambridge and we're going to go and see them. We're booked in. It's a treat for my dad for his uh, 90th birthday. So we're all going to meet up, go, go across together. That's myself. My two sisters, my mum and my dad. Uh, so it's going to be um, in November. This is all happening in November. So that was all confirmed tonight. Right, let me give the boys their apple crusts. Right, sit down, guys. Sit, sit. Good boys. Stay. Yes, good boys. Oh, here you go, sit a little bit more on that one. There you go. Thank you, Snoop. Right, the boys have got their crusts. Who's going to finish first? Who's going to pick the head up? I think Sooty has really. Yeah, I think Sooty's just looking around. Are you all done, Soot? Yeah, okay. That's sort of Sooty. So Snoop one coming through the door. And I think Sooty finished his first. Nice up, please. Right, that's all got to go and recycle. Another tray of um, apple pies finished. I've got one whole tray left yet, so that's good because I'm going shopping tomorrow anyway, so I shall restock. Okay, a lot of trick and treaters walking around when I came home tonight. There's whole groups <laughs> of people walking up and down the road with torches, all in costume. <laughs> so I got in the front door and came straight in the back, <laughs> turned all the lights out, and I was up the garden sorting the boys out, get, getting them out the um, the kennels and feeding them. So uh, what they were doing out the front, I don't know. I haven't got a doorbell, so that's a bit of a Brucey bonus. So. If anybody does come to my door, there's no, nothing to ring. 
and the front of the house was black anyway. The curtains were still open because I was in the back, so it looked like the house was empty. So I think I got away with it. <laughs> I haven't had any knocks on the door anyway. Not at the moment. Might happen later when I'm sat in there this evening with you guys. All right, let's put this on. Oh, here we go. Ah, it's just starting to play up again. I've had a really good week with the microwave this week. It's been working every go, and now it's starting to get a bit sticky again. Right. So, apple pies are on. All right, if we got this end, I'll put the recycles away, get my spoon out. Right, so tomorrow is, thank God for Friday, I've got to bring my tools home, which I can do in my car, but it still gives me the issue of getting my tools back to Cambridge on Monday. Now, I spoke with the uh, assistant service manager over at Cambridge today and I said to her I said I might not be able to get to you on Monday I said because my my van is still clamped I said so um I said I probably won't be able to get in and she said I shall come and get you if I have to <laughs> so I'm like, oh that's good uh, she'll have to bring a van so I can get my tools back though <laughs> So yes, I'm still, it looks, I don't know whether they're gonna to manage to get it done by tomorrow. As far as I know, it's just paperwork. They're trying to sort it all out. So yeah, so that was interesting. Um, what else has happened? It's been a good day. It's been a really nice day today. It's been all service work from the start right to the end, services all day long. So that's been lovely. They're, they're in, they're out. It's a done deal. Uh, yeah, really good. Right, apple pies are done. Just clear it. I'll leave the door open. I think I overdid the custard a little bit. I've got to see a custard, guys. <laughs> Maybe I should have had an extra apple pie. <laughs> right, okay. Let's see if we can carry it through like this. Cool, that's really hot. Ow. Right, let's see if I can get in the front room without burning my fingers. Right, I did lock the back door, didn't I, guys? Let's just double check before I come out of the kitchen. I'll have to drop the camera. Yeah, back door's locked. Turn the light out. Right, let's go in the front room. Are you coming through, guys, or are you staying there? House is lovely and warm. I did just flick the heating off. Uh, after I'd had the shower, I just flicked it all off. So it's still lovely and warm at the moment. Get in the front room. I'll push the door to and we'll see who comes in first. Oh, it's toasty in here. <laughs> really toasty. Right, here we go. Here comes Snoop. I knew we'd leave that door open. I knew you were going to do that. Are you coming in, Sooty? Sooty, you coming in? Sooty? Sooty, come on in. Here you come. I'll have to push the door to. Snoop will open it again when he wants to go. He's not getting any of this. He doesn't have any of my apple pie and custard. He just likes to sit with me. Oh, the next time he comes in during the evening, because he'll go out again. He comes in here for a cuddle now. He's a good boy. And then he'll go out go on his uh, sofa in the doggy day room. And then he comes in later on, about 10 o'clock he comes in to see what I'm up to, because he knows it's bedtime. So yeah, he's really cute. <laughs> right, let me slide my slips off. I'm wearing one of my uh, vest dresses. This one's got quite a high cut round neck. Really comfortable, really body hugging again. Lovely and warm. Sleeves come to about there, so hence why I've got the card on. Um, yeah, it's really comfy, guys. Right, if I get my legs up, I have washed my hair tonight, so it is a little bit damp still. Oh, oh here we go. Oh, oh my poor foot. <laughs> right, let's pull the table a little bit closer. There, how's that? That's good. Right, I can cover my legs now. That's before Snoop opens the door again. Lovely. Right, I did have some of my subscribers who have said they'd like to come to, there goes Snoop, who said they'd like to come to the Scotland and the Birmingham meets, uh, messaged me yesterday, just to confirm that they do want to uh, carry on and come to the meet. So I will message them back again this evening, just to confirm I've got the message and I'll give them uh, some details. Um, so that's I'm gonna do later. Like I said, my Elder sister phoned me early this evening. So um, I phoned her back because she sent a message saying, can you phone me this evening so we can have a chat? 
So I, I phoned her, at, I waited till seven o'clock and I phoned her at seven o'clock. She didn't pick her phone up. So I thought, oh, well, I'll send her a message saying that uh, I'm going to go and have my shower now. I'll, I'll try phoning you again when I come downstairs. My phone rang and it was my eldest sister. She said, you just had trick and treaters turn up at the front door. She said, it's always the way you're at the front door and the phone rings. <laughs> and I said, I know what it's like. So, yeah. So I've had a word with my elder sister and that's to do with my dad's birthday and the um, tribute band, the Rat Pack tribute band who are going to be in Cambridge in November. Um, so that's all sorted. We've got some fine tuning to do. We're going to chat again about this, uh, but we've worked out pick up times. Uh, we're going for a meal as well. So it's going to be a, a, a meal and a show and then back again. So it's going to be quite a long one, but I'm looking forward to it. Um, yeah, so yeah, that's not so far off. That we'll soon be there. And obviously, my I've only got tomorrow, and then I've got the hold of next week, and that's it. I'm on holiday, guys, and that's when it all kicks off when we all start meeting up. <sighs> I'm looking forward to this. Um, so yeah, that's good. I was chatting away with the um tech over at Berry today, the one who works with me. I work with him, he works with me. And um, it was really good because we chat about things that are going on between us both, what he's up to, what I'm up to. He knows everything about me. And um, it's quite interesting. It's very interesting. And he's got a sister who is also, um, I can hear some fireworks going off. Isn't that always the way? They're not close by there. They sound that like they're a fair way off. Uh, but his sister is similar to myself. She's um, uh, not going the conventional route. She's had lots of girl. His sister has had a lot of girlfriends. And uh, I don't think her, his parents or her parents are taking it very well. Or in particular, I think the father is finding it hard to uh, cope with it. Uh, yeah, everything is my uh, mechanic who works with me says, uh, his dad, everything, his dad is, as far as his dad is confer, concerned, everything is black and white. There is no grey areas. And so because of what his sister's up to, the dad can't accept it. And um, yeah, it's causing a lot of friction, apparently. Uh, so that's quite interesting because um, I knew about his sister before um, April actually came out uh, at work. So um, we had conversations about what his sister was up to and that his dad was struggling. And I knew you know, obviously what his sister was going through because his sister had actually come out to her parents and the mother had been fine. Mother had accepted with open arms, but the dad had gone the opposite way. The dad didn't want anything to do with it. And yeah, um, and I thought how lucky I was to have uh, such fantastic parents, such understanding parents. Um, yeah, so wasn't I lucky? Uh, anyway, I'm rattling on, aren't I? It's 13 minutes and 26 seconds I've been rattling away. So I'm going to eat my apple pies now. Um, like I said, I'm going to contact those people who contacted me yesterday saying that they would still like to come to this greeting meet. I'm going to get in touch with those now. Um, if there's anybody out there who hasn't messaged me about this greeting meet in... Uh, <clears throat> Scotland or in Birmingham and they want to just confirm they are still coming do that now uh, time now is 25 to 9 I'll read the messages up to 10 o'clock so if you send me a message in between there I'll get your message um, anyway so if you want to shout out give me give me a message and I'll shout out for you as well but I'm going to sign it now and eat my apple pies and I shall speak to you guys later okay right bye bye for now